Idio, idio, idiosyncrasies, bum bum. Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Idiosyncrasies. I'm your host, Trey. With me as always, Landon and Jared. I just saw Hi. the bolt of lightning. Hi. Yeah, I just saw that too. <laughs> I did it. Oh, maybe that's because you're a goddamn state away. Half a state away. Why are you staring like that? <laughs> So as always, <laughs> a weather boy. Where are your parents? <clears throat> um. So as always, we're gonna talk about the music we want to shout out this week. Jared, kick us off. So I'm gonna share three songs because uh, I want to. <laughs> so number one, Burger King Footless. The air that I breathe by the Hollies. Fucking love the Hollies. Wee Number two. Are, are you ready? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Number two. Uh, Prisoners by John Denver. Love Ooh. me a good bit of Johnny. Johnny boy. Johnny boy. Johnny Mulaney. Number Johnny three. <laughs> Where am I by Duffy Power? Where are you? This I'm is... so sorry. Quickly approaching my top five favorite songs of all time. Ooh. I just like the vibes. Nice. That's all I need. I need the right vibes. Landon. All right. Um, I'm going to choose three songs, too, because we missed last week. Um, first, first, song, first song is uh, True Love Waits by Radiohead. Shit is sad. Um, Learning to Fly by Pink Floyd is number two. It's the first Pink Floyd song I ever added to my liked song. Really? Really? It's a good. It's a good song. I'm doing the 2019 <laughs> remix, 2021 edit, whatever that means. I think it's pretty good. Um, stereo wise, and then my third song, Over the Rain by by Israel. Uh, uh, um, yeah. Ka Kama -ka -we -wo yep. Karma 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 Chameleon. Yep. Yep, boy George. Yep. Why golly. Okay, Trey. We can't hear you. Yep, you're you've got silent. I uh, yeah, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> uh I'm gonna go with I'm just looking up I'm looking up uh O's Rocks Anthem. O's Rock Anthems. Uh, on Spotify right now. Um, we're going to go with... Uh, we're just going to do it randomly here. Um, that one. Blurry by Puddle of Mud. I think that one's already in there. Shut we'll up. Puddle of Mud, the ones who did She fucking hates me. Uh, uh. Yo, you're going on that song, Trey, right? Uh, <laughs> um, Gives You Hell by the All-American Rejects. Great That's a good song. one. I had the same birthday as the lead singer. And then let's just go with uh, Roland from Limp Biscuit. You would. <laughs> you would. <laughs> you would. I would. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Let's keep rolling, rolling, rolling. Um, so before we get into the topic of the evening, um, two things. Do you want to talk about the Halo stream and then what we talked about without Landon present. <laughs> oh, okay. What we talked about, about doing Halo on the stream. Halo stream. Uh, yeah, give me... <clears throat> so, Landon, you and I are set then for the 29th, right? Yes. Like, that's going to work for both of us? Cool. All right. It's a Friday, right? Friday, yep. Yes. 29th of October, 24-hour Halo stream. Landon and I playing through the mainline games. So, yeah, one, two, three, four, playing. five. We are playing Reach. One, yeah, Reach. Okay. two, three, three ODST. Four, oh, we're playing ODST as well? Five, yes. Might okay. As well. Might, as, might as well. That's true. That is. Yeah. Uh, that would be the weird one to just leave out. <laughs> yeah. It's, actually, it's probably on my top three favorites, to be honest. Okay. okay. So, yeah. So, we're doing all of the Halo shooter games. None of the yes. RTS ones. Not Halo Wars. I don't think... We I don't think RTS would really be that fun. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> you want to watch us sit 
and do nothing for hours. <laughs> I mean, that's gonna be like the regular stream. <laughs> that's but, gonna be with the streamers uh, anyway. Uh, it'd just be even more boring with an RTS game. I yeah. personally, I played it. Um, I'm not an RTS guy. I I got stuck on level two. I no idea what I was doing. I know it's important to the story because it introduces introduces yeah. the banished, which is a really important thing for Infinite. But that's right. Just nah. read the books. Uh, but yeah, Landon Landon also sent me a. You sent me. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to speak about you as if you're not here now. Um, you you also sent me the the list of like things we can do on stream. Did you call me? Do you call me Lance when I'm not here? <laughs> Is that what you just said? No, I don't call you Lance when you're not here. I don't think I. <laughs> I do. I mean, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> I was to say I don't think I call you Lance like unironically. Like if I'm calling you Lance, I'm probably joking about something. Yes. Yeah. Okay. But yeah, you sent me uh, a list of like stuff we can do, like skulls, stream skulls that we can do. Yeah. Um, and those are really cool. So I'm looking forward to getting those somewhere. Did, making did you have any? wanting to modify any of those i know that there were some that was still kind of in the air like there was one it was like chicken suit question mark <laughs> uh if you have a chicken suit i'm down to do it but i don't have a chicken uh, suit nor am i get getting a chicken, a chicken suit. suit i'll have to get a chicken suit um but yeah there was i mean there were some some that seemed like duplicates but we can talk about that yeah off off camera where's my um, phone but Landon and I will be at we'll be doing them all couch co op at my house in this office, um, so expect lots of technical issues because now do th you doing things live is bad. Now, do you want to do LAN so there be two screens, or do you want to do <laughs> split screen? I think it'll just be easier to just do a split screen. Okay, I might just bring. My Xbox, just in case. Well, I'm. I might need you to bring oh. your Xbox because I gave my Xbox to my brother. Oh, okay. Yeah, so yeah. I might need you to just bring yours anyway. Okay. Yeah, I'll have to bring. I don't think PC has split screen yet. No. If no. they ever have that, so yeah, we can just. I can just bring my Xbox. Okay. Um, but if um, need be, what we could do is just use our PCs too to do a LAN. True. Um, true. So, because I feel like footage of split screen can be a little much. For. I don't know. We can we can figure something out. Maybe uh, we'll maybe you can come yeah. over and like um, we'll we'll do a test or something. Uh, yeah, yeah. Like the day before. Or something like that. Right. Um. Here, I wonder if I, can... <laughs> I would just like to read off some of my favorites. I say I don't want to bog I don't want to bog us down too much with this, but you have to have one where people can make you take a shot. No. no. I thought about that and I didn't I didn't look for that yeah. and I was like the last time I played <laughs> Halo to like to as a special thing is when i got drunk and i'm like not doing that again like i'm just yeah. I'm not doing that uh oh yeah scarab gun skull is a great one uh, that is restart the whole level i like the black eye skull uh play with eyes squinted for one minute yep uh <laughs> recession skull play far from the tv for three minutes yeah, yeah. My TV is mounted on the wall, and the futon we will be sitting on is on the other side of the room. I don't know how okay, much so farther we're going to get from the TV. Outside, so we'll look through the window. Have to, like, we'll have to, like, <laughs> leave. <laughs> what? One, someone has to leave, leave the room. That's fair. It's a, and, it's a and swivel mount, so we can just leave yeah. the room and turn the TV. <laughs> right, right. And Or what we could do is have one person stay in, one person leave. Oh, yeah. And then just have the other person kind of... <laughs> Give call outs to what's another, supposed to happen. I have, I have another one called Swarm Skull. I just have bugs exclamation. <laughs> <mark>. Bugs. <laughs> I don't uh, know exactly what you want to do with that. That's just wrong. Skull. Ladybugs. <laughs> uh, so the lady. Maybe I can just like unleash a like a bag of crickets into your room. Don't fucking do that. I can be good. Be I'll good. just make the trip home. And hide outside, and Landon will just send me like text messages. <laughs> do it now, and I'll just throw bugs in your room. <laughs> yeah, please we'll don't destroy do the that. whole ecos ecosystem of your neighborhood. <clears throat> please don't fucking do that. <laughs> destroy the ecosystem of my neighborhood with crickets <laughs> and ladybugs. <laughs> and ladybugs. I, you can buy a thousand ladybugs on eBay, or not on eBay, on Amazon for like ten bucks. All right, Trey, share your idea for what you want to do on the 29th as well. All right, so obviously. No shave November's coming up. Uh, Lan Jared is already committing to shaving off. Um, I've committed for twenty, almost twenty-three years to not growing anything. 
Uh, so that's easy. Landon, uh, unfortunately, you've not uh, had a position yet. So that's got to go. I'll give him a position. <laughs> and uh, I say we do it. During the... live. <laughs> I say that that's a uh, that's a donation goal or something that uh, you you shave your. We hit a certain amount. You shave everything on stream. No, oh, he just has to do it. He just has to do it. Okay, fair yeah. enough. Yeah. I was gonna. Doing it. I was gonna make it a little okay. harder to get to, but <laughs> I would say I would say we get to a certain amount and. Uh, I think you're just putting a lot of faith in you to actually that's, like, that's true. have everything be working for that's one and two actually last 24 hours. That's a good point as well. <laughs> we'll have a uh, fail safe. The fail safe is the stream will stop and I'm going to bed. The fail safe <laughs> is if it is shorter than 24 hours, Landon has to shave off all his facial hair. True. How about that? True. Okay. <laughs> that's, okay. that's, our, that's Landon's will to keep me going is he doesn't want to have to shave off his beard. Yeah. But either way, uh, we're all participating in No Shave November. Do, do, yes, uh, I'll participate. Um, do you want to do just Legendary? Or do you want to do Legendary All Skulls on? Because I feel like each level will take like 17 hours of work. I, I was going to say, let's, let's just, do just do Legendary. Because I, I you have completed. stuff in here to actually put Skulls on, don't you? Like, Or I guess we do it ourselves is what it does. Yeah. Okay. I, I tried it. There's no way you can turn Skulls on mid -game. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. So and yeah, I we'll just leave them off because that'll be that'll be. I also, yes. I also found out that there was a playlist. You know how like Halo MCC has playlists. Yeah. There's two of them. There's the Halo Saga and the Master Chief Legendary Saga, where it has only one through four because those were made before they came right. out with like Reach and ODST and stuff. So we can't do the playlist, which kind That's of fine. sucks. But. As, as you know, we can just finish one game, which plays all. If we just have it like quick start or something, we'll play the whole game, right, and then right. we'll just when that ends, we'll just go to the next one. Yeah. Um. So yeah. So if you could talk for one species of animal telepathically, what would it be and why? <laughs> Dogs. Why? Uh, it's literally my job. That's that's not really what I'm talking about. At a pet at a pet store, literally all I do with dog. It'd be so nice if I could just talk to a dog and be like, "What do you want? What ails you, friend?" Yeah. Obviously, your pet parent knows. You know, your owner knows. Your pet uh, parent. That's what we have to call. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah, that's like a pet parent has walked into the store. Yada yada. I'm not. I'm calling. Paul right. Why did Why did that sound like the fucking dog and Ropa? Like. A murder has taken place in the school. <laughs> a pet parent has walked into the building. <laughs> a murder has That's taken place in the school. <laughs> Look, Danganronpa, weird fucking series of games, all right? <laughs> um, I would like to be referred to as Doggy Daddy. That's it. Is that I'm an done. option? <laughs> I'm going home. I'm going home. I'm done. That's it. Hey, Trey, tell us about Lisa and Genshin. <laughs> She called me naughty boy and I wasn't ready. <laughs> I like I like how twice now I've sent that stupid meme of like here's a little thing for, Gensh for Genshin Impact players that can age of consent is eighteen. I've sent that twice now and no one has yeah. responded. No one has um, responded to Tickers did the other day. He, he's like Yeah, yeah. Oh did he? Yeah, oh, I, I didn't see it. Yeah, I think he like added you or just directly replied and mm -hmm. he was just like LOL. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna keep on every time <laughs> someone mentions it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna send that. <laughs> uh, Justin said it. He was like, "Genshin is a good game. Changed my mind. You're gonna send it to him now." Yes, okay. I didn't see that he sent it. I'll send it. Yeah, there you go. I got saved my word. <laughs> um, what, what, what animals would you guys want to be telepathically connected to? Well, I was gonna say cat, but I feel like since you said dog, that kind of covers it. Uh, Shit, as far sorry, as like man. domesticated. <laughs> Pets. <laughs> um, I just want to know what the fuck squirrels are thinking. I was. I think I want to know what the fuck frogs are thinking. Honestly, like what frogs? What are they doing in the road like that? Where, where are they hopping to? Where are they gotta so, go? I got this question from a TikTok. They're going, man. They don't have a mission. They just, they're, just, they're, they're just going. Their, their whole life is just yeah. They're just going. <laughs> it was like any, it was a clip. <laughs> any direction is the right direction for them. You know, that's... It was a clip from a podcast where they. 
asked that question and the guy was like i feel like 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 a deep sea fish he's like how often do you come across deep sea fish <laughs> <dumb ass?" laughs> he's like but if it happens i just want to be like what's going on now <laughs> what's going on what are you doing here dude oh uh yeah, just in case if he does come up you'd be like now I know what's wrong. <laughs> now I know what's going on. <laughs> yeah, I think, I think very, like the direct instance, quote. Instance, kind of now I've thrown him off his rhythm. <laughs> All right. All right. All right. That's so, it. That's the show. I think uh, it's now time to talk about the big. Uh, so, yeah. So, media everybody's, takeover. Been, everybody's been talking about, yeah, the next, the big media takeover. Squid Game. Oh, I'm bad for real. <laughs> I uh, I just finished it today. I binged it all today, and mm-hmm. just finished it like thirty minutes ago. A occasion. There's like what nine episodes. <laughs> it's nine episodes. It was nine hours. <laughs> it's an, I was... Damn, Hey, there was really one episode that was only anything. half an hour. Oh, was it? I I guess I just. I think so. I don't know. I think they they varied, but fair enough. Right, yeah, I finished you, it two days ago. Do you guys think that there's going to be a season two? I did think it was already confirmed. Has it been confirmed already? Damn. I think so. Could be wrong. I'll Google it. Yeah, that'll be interesting then. Because, like, spoilers for anybody who hasn't watched it and wants to watch it still. Um, get over yourself. <laughs> it's, it's, um, it has not it has not been announced as the show actually hasn't been renewed for another series yet. Um that um Doc the director playing Don Yuck, whatever it is, mm-hmm. uh, did confirm however that he didn't have any fleshed out plans for a second series yet. Gotcha. So it, might, it might be a little while. Yes, yeah, because what I had heard is he had been trying to get the show like a network to pick it up for like over ten years. Yeah. Ten years, yeah. And just that. no one wanted it. I think he also said that like or they said that like he, he was also kind of the same situation where he had no money at all. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like he was kind of the same situation as a character. So what what did you guys think of it? It's I, it's heavy. <laughs> I liked it. Like I liked it. Yeah. I liked it uh, a lot. I, I loved it in fact. I thought it was really, really good. One of the best things I've watched in a while, I think. I I uh did you watch it dub or sub? Uh I watched it dub. Okay, so I I watched like the first seven episodes dub and then I was just like can't do this anymore. And then I watched the last two sub and I honestly I enjoyed it a lot more. Like I kinda wanna go back and rewatch it only sub. Mm -hmm. to get the full experience just because like the subtitles didn't even match up with the dub so you could tell that the subtitles were more (laughs) accurate to what they were saying you you have to be careful because i was told that uh if you have it in korean um dub but english sub or something like that they're not actually saying that like like yeah i was gonna say it's the closest translation to english they can come up with yeah a korean translator said that like it's completely raw so Mm. yeah Yeah. that's what kind of well that's what uh, i kind of figured too because like right away because i watched it because jared told me that like the the dub was kind of not great so i was like well i'll start it with sub then i'll you know i'll pay attention and whatnot I kind of switched different points in the series if i was like doing something i just quickly throw it into the dub to listen to it yeah but it was like I'd be watching it, and I'm like, that doesn't sound like something somebody would say. Like that doesn't feel like a natural thing someone would say. And it's like, oh, like it's being translated. Like that's likely just gonna happen. Like, <laughs> right, right. I, I personally, I watched it <laughs> dub. I didn't, I didn't really wasn't bothered by it. But then again, like my dad made me grow up on like karate movies, so like watching yeah. English speakers talk over, you know, Asian voice actors for like the lips don't sync up at all i mean you're gonna get that and also just the acting is just very dramatic and over the top. i was gonna say there were some that didn't bother me uh ji han or ji hun didn't bother me too much in parts uh which one's that one i'm trying to the, ma- the, the main, main guy main, yeah. main guy um sang woos was pretty good and Cy bx was pretty good as well but then it was like the old man was just weird his was pretty bad like he oh, sounded, oh. he sounded, yeah. His his was like 
very stereotyped. It's like yeah, very wispy old man. <laughs> yeah, with yeah. the old man. It's like okay. I just, I, I, I saw a man. TikTok to get today where <clears throat> it was uh, like the guy making the video was doing his own dub over it with the voices, and it was when they first get to the honeycomb game. Okay. And <laughs> he's like, you know what game this is? He's like. It's nipple twisties. <laughs> it's, like, it's like you have to you have to trace the shape around a person's nipple, and if they flinch, they get a twisty. <laughs> and then it, it was Ali. He he was doing that and like in the show. It's because he's trying to think of the word for yeah. circle, and he's like, yeah. so you have to massage around it like this. It's like oh, like this. <laughs> the old man is like oh. We played nipple twisties all the time when I was little. <laughs> and it's so fucking funny. That's like, I just like, yeah, it's just like, like the bad lip reading, but worse. <laughs> yeah, but the guy yeah. doing the dub, it sounded exactly like the English dub. That's why it was so funny. Right, right. I love that. I love that. Yeah, I thought I thought it was a really, really good show. Um, yeah. At, I, at, at the one point with the old man. Shit, are we cool to spoil it? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. We're good. We're good. Well, when when he died, quotation marks. I I bawled. I, I cried. Uh, that whole scene of that him, whole like, fucking man. marbles game. Oh, fucking God. fuck yeah. me up. That That's was the heaviest yeah. episode for sure. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and the whole like, thing about like the girl sacrificing herself and yeah. stuff like that, and then the dude betraying. fucking Song Wu. That son of a bitch. I, that I pit made me so mad. Yeah, <laughs> I was oh, like that. Like he was doing that the whole game. Like he yeah, I was like, right. that was really the climax of him just like fully like I'm not even gonna try to hide it that much anymore. I'm in this to win type. Mm -hmm. But like, I don't know. <laughs> or like at the very end, uh, where, so he where he stabs. Um, I can't oh, stabs uh, Sai Cy Yeah. 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 yeah like where uh, Ji Hoon was knocking on the door and he turns around and there he is. Yeah, they're like, coming with the coffin. I yeah. I, I told Jared, because, like, I had just finished that episode when we started playing Overwatch. And I was like, mm -hmm. I really, she was the only one I wanted to win. Like, she was the only one. Her and, her and, uh, Ji Young. Or Jai yeah. Young. Um, like, those were the only two that was like, damn, you're kind of just in here for a okay reason, I guess. Like, you're not a piece of shit. Like, yeah. Cybiak was literally in there to just help her brother at that point and get her mother across yeah. from, from North Korea. Like, North Korea, yeah. Like, damn. This dude just yeah. bets on horses and is an asshole. I check so. Yeah. <laughs> Tong Wu, on the other hand, he betrays his whole, you know, he lies to his mother, saying he's doing a bunch of stuff and stuff yeah. like that, and then he tries to, like, sell his mother's shop. Asshole. He did sell his mother's shop. He put it up as collateral. Yeah. Like, he's... What yeah. did you think about the twist? Did you... That, uh... Okay, I'm... I'm... I'm kind of I'm kind of stupid. I didn't see it coming though. That yeah, so you watched it really yeah. early. I kind of had heard rumors about it, so like I wasn't too surprised about it. But like, I mean, like I it's like, know. oh, okay, it kind of makes sense. He's yeah, the oldest person there. He's number one. Oh, okay. I was gonna say, yeah. are we talking about Il Num or uh, the the front man, old bastard. Yeah, yeah. I I didn't see that one coming. And like I hadn't heard any rumors about anything. Like I did yeah. not see that coming. Yeah, no, I yeah, I watched it like right when it was starting to get big. So yeah. I didn't hear anything. Uh, I just saw one meme about honeycomb. The last yeah. 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 The last uh the last episode had that thing where they like they tell it and he gets the note. And I literally like said out loud, I was like finishing it on let's sit out loud, I'm like he, did he die like i, I couldn't remember yeah. if he got shot like if the gunshot went off or like because i know they didn't show it and they did yeah. not shy away from showing it for anybody and that should have struck something in my mind but i mean yeah. i thought it was clever because at first i thought they were doing that just so because like, it was like a showed sympathy everyone else's death. it was like you know sympathetic for yeah Jim and also the uh well they didn't show ollie movie. getting shot either that's true. No, but they we just but heard yeah, it. But we heard it. Yeah, but, that's a good point. But they 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 showed uh that one girl getting mm -hmm. shot. They they watched yeah, but we also movie. only really had a connection with her for two episodes. But see, yeah, yeah, that's what because that's what I think threw me off too is like I didn't think much about it because we didn't see Ali get shot. So I was like, yeah. oh, they're just sparing us from these characters that we've spent 
more time with that so we don't have to see them die yeah but yeah i did not see that coming i i don't think it mattered i mean i guess like for this first season like i, I don't know i don't think it did anything for me like oh he was the one behind it i was like i still don't we still don't know really anything about why they're doing this so it, yeah. it's like cool he's he's there now he's dead hey i, I... <laughs> <laughs> We all just want Go to ahead, play. Landon. My my only problem, the the one thing I did not like was, I mean, I thought like the whole was like, oh, he's just a rich dude being bored. Like, I, I kind of a letdown, but it wasn't the worst thing. What I didn't right. like though was I didn't like the group of people, mm. the uh, VIPs, that, the VIPs. Yeah, I, I thought yeah. that was kind of like redundant. I thought that was kind of like, uh, it, you could have just did the one dude. I also it didn't make any sense because. He says that he's been well. He's been doing this for years since like the eighties, nineties, whatever. So like 90s. 20, 30 years. And he said that he always wants to be in the game. He always wants to be in the game. Um, but then it shows. Oh, you're not. You're not gonna watch it. Well, I, that one part. Yeah, that, yeah. that part kind of threw me off. Where it was like, well, does he enjoy watching it, or does he enjoy? That's my only. Well, I took it as. Like, he organized it. He started this whole thing, and this, like, he spent that whole time watching it, watching and then this was the one time he was in it. Yeah. And um, then, I think, uh, I think and then like, the he made that connection with Gihan, so he didn't want to watch it after that. I see. I thought they were saying that um, he always wanted to play the game. But no. I, guess, I guess that's just the one he did. Okay. I yeah, see. yeah. Okay. And, like, VIPs because I of the metaphor for capitalism, right? And well, like yeah, all I that stuff, that. like those were the thought... heads of every major country. Yeah. <laughs> I get that and stuff. I just think it was a little redundant, in my opinion. Just I don't know. It was kind of interesting oh, yeah. though to see it from like the outside view. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's cool. It's cool. I just think you know, story wise, I think it would just would have been better if it was just one old dude. I mean, I think the point of it, yeah, because like, like they, because like they, I mean, the guy says it too at one point that like you're all horses or like you bet on horses, yeah. we bet on people. That's the whole point. They're just in that scene when we first meet yeah. them. They're all talking about like, yeah. oh, I bet on this guy. I bet on this guy. Who'd you bet on? I got a million. I'm doubling my stakes. And like yeah, we say, were introduced to this character like getting crippled by his gambling addiction. If it were just the one guy, there wouldn't really be motivation to bet. Mm. <laughs> like, yeah. right? True. Right. True. You're right. You're right. Um, another thing too, I thought was kind of confusing was that, like, how do you get involved in it? Like, for they example, they yes, they know <laughs> obviously, but like, like for one thing, the the head runner of it, like the guy with the black mask, being the detective's brother. Apparently, he you know he won. A game in the past oh yeah yeah so was yeah. Like, yeah i just won this so i now, i think it's a combination it. of so like are you talking more about how do they run it or how did the vips get involved how no how did the how did the front man like, get picked how did the front man get picked did, yeah i was gonna say i think those that's people's theories for season two they think gihan is going to okay. be the one running the game yeah or trying to destroy it so I thought that's how it was going to go once that, like, once that was the reveal, I was like, oh, so whoever wins this is going to be a Charlie and the Chocolate Factory kind of thing, that they're yeah. going to take the mantle, they're going to take that place. That's what I thought, too. Yeah, because, I mean, obviously, like, the person slash persons who win are going to be, like, the only people who know about the game in right. general, and, like, they obviously have this insane amount of money that they can use. Because, I mean, like, I think for the VIPs, chances are they just climbed the ladder of having money. So, like, they were contacted about this. Or like, hey, do you want something more exciting to bet on? But, so, like, I think it's sort of two different trails that reach the same end, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. But, yeah, but yeah, yeah that, that's the big thought. theory I, for yeah. season I, two. I really like that, that, like, it makes you think, you know? And a lot of people are hitting the theory of... Ilnam being Gihan's dad, which I don't agree with. I, I think yeah, that's yeah. a coincidence. Because yeah. like, they literally have different family names. <laughs> right, <laughs> like, right. And then people are like, oh, but like, he said this, like, I grew up in a town just like this, and Gihan said, me too. 
Yeah, a lot of the towns in Korea it's... look very similar. Like, <laughs> like, wow, just look similar. Houses, the walls, and I can pick like four different towns Wait, in Ohio and they all look like mine. That doesn't. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so that was the interesting part is like with this being like a Korean show, how they sort of elaborated about like Korean socioeconomic climate yeah, type yeah, stuff because yeah. you don't get that that much mm-hmm. in America. Well, how much? Yeah. I meant to look it up. How much is 10,000 won? Um, so yeah i did the conversion essentially like one cent is like a hundred won or something like that okay so it's like like ten like one dollar was like a yeah okay basically one one dollar is because that's i was zero 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 eighty four u.s dollar what was that one yeah one u.s dollar is one thousand one hundred ninety six one yeah so it's basically one to one thousand Okay. Yeah. That's just how I simplified it in my head. So okay. how many So the grand prize was like forty five point seven million, roughly. Was it million or <laughs> in American? It was billion in one. One, two, three. Uh one, two, three, four, five, six. So it would be thirty eight thousand. Yep. Million. million. Yeah, it's million. Forty five million six hundred thousand? Billion. 45- yeah, forty-five point seven million. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. How much would it be in Filipino peso? That, that is an important question. <laughs> they do mention the Philippines in the show. That is an important question. Because yeah. yeah, that was I. Because they like everything came down to like that ten thousand one. Like that was just like the staple. Like hey, how much am I taking on the bank? Ten thousand one. Ten thousand one. So yeah. I was like, how much? Like how much is that? It's like okay, ten bucks. That makes sense. Yeah. Damn, that makes that whole horse thing kind of real shitty. Then, like, he wins. Is like, hey, here, here's ten bucks. Thanks for your, thanks for your, t- uh, here's your tip. Like, oh, you just won like four thousand dollars. You're giving her ten bucks. Okay. And then he asks for it back. And then he, and then you ask for it back. Yeah, I. They did such a good job of like setting this guy up as like a shitty human being. Like, I don't want to root for this guy at all. And then, yeah. Like, honestly, I wouldn't even say turning that around. Like, I don't think they change that at all throughout the show. Like, at, at getting to the end, I'm like, I still don't want to root for you. You're still just, like, you're going to go back I, and not I, do much better. No, I, view, I viewed it as, like, it's more or less he didn't change, but we're seeing more sides. Yeah. Because not only, because, like, a, what a lot of shows do when they talk about, like, people in debt is that they only really focus on one person. Mm-hmm. Or they focus on a large amount of people where it's hard to, you know, relate to. Instead, they, I mean, obviously, you know, first starts with 400, but really we only focus on like 10 to 20 people most, and they each have their own reasons for right. why they're there. And they're all very solid reason, reasons, you know. Um, and they're all as equal of, you know, detriment to mm-hmm. Jihoon, or Jihoon, whatever you say his name. So I I think that makes him, but he's still like he's not doing it out of greed, like Sang Woo or any of them, right? For right. Most, the majority, because a lot of them, it's like even though they are in debt, and they need help. A lot of it is for greed reasons, you know. Right. Um, at least Ji Hoon, he's doing it for his daughter. You know? That's true, and I guess the reason he decided to go back was that he needed money for his mom for his and his surgery. mom too. Yeah. So that's that's yeah. a good point. That fucked me up to at the end. Like, he just comes home and yeah. she's dead. Yeah. That's rough. How did you guys feel about uh, Duck Sue's death? The gang guy. The which one? The gang guy. About his death. Oh. The one with, like, the tattoo on his face. Yeah. yeah. Um, I was kind of surprised that the crazy chick, that she would sacrifice herself to kill him. yeah that kind yeah. of surprised me because like her whole arc is her doing what she can to survive and then yeah, she just then throws she... it away out of pettiness because she's right. like i told you i'd get you back and then kills herself yeah i was right. like that just like that didn't seem at all in character but that, yeah that's one that was kind of like ooh, that was a lot i didn't see that coming out like, yeah cool. especially because she started as the woman who didn't get to name her child yet <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, that was so, I thought that was going to be a much bigger thing when that happened. And then it's like, "Oh, okay, we're past that now." <laughs> yeah. And then the they other one that joke. really got me was after the marble game, the husband and wife couple. Fuck. And then that yeah. guy 
got his wife uh, killed and then he I, hung himself. Yeah. That was awful too. And like everyone's yeah. realization of like, oh, I'm going against you. Like I just picked you because I trust you and now I have to go against yeah. you. Yeah, that really sucked. That really, really did suck. Uh that one that me. one episode, yeah, me, me. the fucking marbles game, is gonna be like textbook. <laughs> just betrayal yeah. and everything. That that was such yeah, a even good when, fucking episode. Even when, like uh the old man was pretending to have uh Fuck. Yeah. Uh, what did I say again? Oh, what well, did he... you say? You know, it was like giving. <laughs> he realized, <laughs> or then he like made uh, Jihoon realize that, like, oh, even though you tried to trick me and stuff. Mm -hmm. Oh fuck! Oh, fuck! But, like, what, but what would you do? You know, because like your life and forty-five billion dollars or uh, won is on the line. You know, right? Right. So, what would you do? You know, anyone would do it. Yeah, it's just. Man. Yeah, yeah. I'd probably kill you off for forty-five. I, I, I'll say sorry <laughs> if, if it was between you and forty-five billion, forty-five billion dollars. You know, I'd forty-five million dollars. I'd take advantage of you. Oh, okay. <laughs> sorry. What else would you do? You take advantage of me, even with that. <laughs> we'll talk after. <laughs> All right. Maybe we can strike up a deal. <laughs> Maybe we can strike up a deal. You got forty-five million on you? Yeah. I'll put oh. you two in a box and then a knife. <laughs> All right, so here's the thing. And then I'll, I'll everyone put in like everyone put in all of their life savings. We're gonna recreate Squid Game. Best I can do is like maybe four hundred <laughs> bucks. <laughs> yeah, 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 I'm I'm no better. You can at most maybe win or buy a PS5. There, there you go. Ooh, that who that might be worth. <laughs> get, get a communal PS5. Communal PS5. <laughs> Uh, trying to think um trying to think what else was like really cool in that show all of it i just i just keep thinking of the marvel marvel episode that was i okay and i i might be again i might be a dumbass i do not understand the squid game i do not i, 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 I don't I, either i i, I, I honestly so I, yeah i tried <laughs> rewatch i tried rewatching that intro like three four times even after i watched the show and i, I went, got and then i, got I watched it. the kids play it, and then i watched jihoon and sangwoo play it and i'm like they're just running around a box stabbing each other <laughs> i don't understand <laughs> were the kids well, doing that too they, Damn, I missed playing, that episode. they were playing because whoever like survived would win that's right. why they were yeah. stabbing each other but yeah, yeah. so like you have the circle you have the triangle you have the box yeah. and then you have like the spot across the like the right. so the person <laughs> on the outside can only hop on one foot the person on the inside is keeping them out of the box so they have to go to one of the arms and run across it and then once they get across that, then they can use two feet, and then they have to go to the bottom of the box, and then they have to tap the head with one foot, which is the circle. Mm -hmm. So then the people on the inside are just keeping them from doing that. It's really just two objectives. Right. Cross the box, <laughs> and then touch the head. Okay. That's and then the people on the inside only have the one objective. Don't let them do that shit. Don't let them do that. Interesting. Don't stab I mean... yourself in the neck. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> it's a really big trope i know it's a lot in a lot of like uh eastern movies or like a lot of asian movies the the whole you know what balls to the wall he's about to stab me go through the hand like the amount of times oh that, that yeah the amount of times i i have seen that in like karate movies or even anime like Naruto so does that like six times <laughs> i see that and i raise you the amount of kicks to the face when a person's on the ground that's another yeah. really yeah. big one just yeah. straight yeah. leg kick to the yeah. face yeah just even like just kicks in general because even in like the uh the riot when they were all in the mm -hmm. like sleeping area a guy would just be standing and a guy would run up and just kick him in the stomach I... like straight and push him back it i was, was gonna like, say there was like the, a there was like a like, the part setting where, uh... up shot Sorry, go ahead. <laughs> no, you're good. It, the part where they took all the extra food and then the big bully, whatever his name is, he just kicked. He literally <laughs> yeah, kicked that guy. Yeah. He literally kicked him to death. Well, like, during damn, that fucking during that fucking first fight scene, that riot, there's just like an establishing shot of everything going on, and there's a dude I swear to God jumped and did a fucking high knee kick into somebody else. It's like that was not necessary. That was incredibly extra. 
You did not need to do that. <laughs> like that oh, man yeah, was there to an earn extra trade. <laughs> <laughs> that, that man was there to earn his pay and nothing more. <laughs> Look, I know that we're playing a bunch of like children's games <laughs> to the you know for life and death. Kill you, bro. I'm fucking kill you. Going to, it's I am personal. Going to, I'm gonna drop kick you from ten feet in the air. The coolest way possible. The coolest and way I don't possible. Care. I don't care. Ugh. If I'm gonna go out dramatic, I'm gonna go out dramatic. See, Man, if I this were in the squid game, I would have gotten my team to stack their beds super fucking high and just got to the piggy bank. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Yeah. Exactly. It seemed like exactly. a realistic option. Right. <laughs> like I, I know, but don't you think that the No. Not to, no. Not to burst your bubble. The soldiers or whatever. No. Probably not in time. I don't. Probably not right away. There, I mean, they were watching the entire time, but I just don't think they would do anything because I think they'd let it play out with the argument that if they have money in there, then they're gonna fight each other. <laughs> yeah, true, true. Yeah. But so yeah, the whole B plot of the cop and like the guy ending up being his brother—that was yeah. super interesting. But there was really no payout for the yeah. cop. <laughs> yeah, it was just uh, a long, winded way to reveal who the main guy was. Yeah, Which we have no the, connection to. The the videos and pictures, they didn't go through, did they? Uh, no, I doubt it, considering yeah. we saw Gihan a year later and the Squid Games are still going on. Right. Sure, sure. Um, what about the C-plot of the organs black market selling thing? The... Yeah. Well, that was kinda... that it, I don't know. I feel like that might be a cultural thing. Because like, that was prevalent with the beginning, too, where Gihan, like, signed away his, like, physical oh, rights to true. certain body parts. Like, black market just seemed yeah. like a very prevalent thing across the board. That's a good point. And I think they were just trying to show that to show that there is, like, um, well, yes, most there, of There's the... a market for your organs? No, no. No, that, that there's, like, like a yeah. seedy underbelly of the Squid Game itself. Yeah, yeah like, that there's, like, people Corruption in the within... game that are not with, you know, Full mm -hmm. intent yeah. of playing yeah. the game. Mo most of them are and stuff like to the point where they'll take their mask off just to get shot, kind of situation like that. One, you know, is like you're just a kid kind of situation. He just goes up and shoots him. Mm -hmm. you know? He he knew, you know, that was gonna happen and stuff. Fucking nuts. Yeah, I, I, I do love I do I do love the memes though. The amount of memes that are coming out. <laughs> like I, I love the one. It was uh it was G opening up the 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 can or whatever of the honeycomb or whatever it showed uh the guy from invincible being like bent over really thick and stuff and he just starts looking at <laughs> <laughs> what was speaking of being bent over fucking uh, yep. the... <laughs> well no like during the fucking honeycomb stuff there's like it's a stab an yeah, establishing yeah, shot yeah. of everybody like carving out their stuff yeah. Gihon is just laying down ass like fucking yeah. to the heavens. It's like a, it's like a cat. <laughs> he's he's getting ready to receive, and I just that yeah. floored me. Like that came up, and I could not. I, was like, I had to pause and shot? just like I couldn't. I could not watch the fucking show at that point. Yeah. <laughs> Another part I... in that was the the lady with the lighter hiding under the slide. It's like, it shows how bright the lighter is and the yeah. guy standing right next to her. It's like, that you know too. for a fact he, he just saw her doing it. Like, <laughs> yeah, yeah I that was... Understand. If, if they're able to catch someone that broke off like a tip <laughs> right. of the umbrella or something, but they can't catch someone lighting a lighter under <laughs> that. And then not only her, but then he... She gives it to the bully, yeah. and then he does the exact same thing. And like, would you not like be kind of curious? Oh, that one she just left. That guy got up, picked something up from the ground, and also went to the exact same spot that she was just in. <laughs> right. And well, not only that, when he noticed the lighter, he like threw his leg around, kicked up so yeah, much yeah. dirt to cover it with his foot. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, like wow, that was very nonchalant. <laughs> yeah. And also, I love how someone went all the way up to the ladder. Like down the, yeah, the, the, the slide. top of the slide, what? and then there was also the guard just also there too. <laughs> I was say one of my favorite ones is there's been a couple TikToks, but it's the red light green light game. It's like me if I was in Squid Game and he's frozen. You hear it go red light and he's frozen, and you see him go. 
<laughs> like a bunch of firing sounds go off because the guy himself like mm. says it when he was playing. Yeah, that's just that's so fucking funny. I uh, I've also seen a TikTok too where it's like red light green light, but every time it would be like a, 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 there's that you or that TikTok guy who's like really thick for no reason, and it'd be like yeah you know, yeah green light red light, and he'll just turn around, <laughs> <laughs> just, just like showing off what's behind him. Damn, I gotta oh, I gotta man. look up some of these memes. I've not seen anything like I like I said I just finished it today. I've not seen any of the memes yet today. I'm gonna try well, to I... find the nipple twisties. <laughs> okay, okay. Yeah. Uh, I love <laughs> so how fucking funny. It. It's... It's almost become like almost like a JoJo situation where I'm seeing people. Oh my God, is that a squid? Game is that reference? a squid games reference? <laughs> Pro tip: if you look up nipple twisties in TikTok, nothing shows up. <laughs> oh, well, that's that's a little disappointing, honestly. Oh <laughs> uh, wait, uh, I posted this one on Facebook. Wait, let's see if that works. Oh, <laughs> oh, I did, I did see that one. Yeah. Love that yeah. one. So now I'm bad. incognito nipple twisty squid game. I because I, I saw that I saw that you posted that one, Landon, and that's what like. All right, I'm gonna go watch the show now. Yeah, I completely like in my mind. I'm thinking when I because I saw that and I'm like, oh, so this is like an older version of this guy. Could not have. I was no. very surprised when number yeah. one showed up ten minutes or like however long into Whoa, that first is this episode. A show about the, about time is this travel. Time travel? <laughs> um uh, it's funny too because like all i've been doing on facebook and like social media has just been sharing yeah good game memes that's all i've been doing just because i love it so much and then one of my co-workers she was like now i understand it i watched the show and now i she like confronted mm-hmm. me at work she looked at me and she's like now i understand it I'm like what are you talking about she's like the swim game memes i get it now i'm like oh okay i'm sorry i didn't mean to be the first one... news feed with the I, I saw, I, I stand corrected on myself, I did see one after watching it, like, before we started this, mm. but it was, like, comparing the characters to Twilight characters, I'm like, well, great, now I gotta fucking watch the Twilight franchise to understand yeah. this meme. <laughs> uh, I love Twilight. I sent you guys the TikTok, but I also kind of yeah. just want to play the audio. <laughs> okay. Yeah, just play the audio. Yeah, yeah. Let me turn my, uh, voice pressure <laughs> Well, any ideas? It could be nipple twisties. What the fuck is that? One person uses their finger to draw a shape around the nipple. If you flinch, you get a twisty. <laughs> oh shit. Hmm? I have really sensitive nipples. <laughs> Did you hear that? Little flower nipples over here can't even handle a simple game of nipple twisties. <laughs> oh wow! Sounds just like a little bitch. Old bitch nipples. Any advice? Massage. Massage. Oh, you mean like that? Massage. Yes, that's right. <laughs> just like that, sir. <laughs> Fucking hell. <laughs> oh Fucking... my god. They sounded like him, too. You yeah, right. it did. Like... Little bitch flower nipples. <laughs> <laughs> I really hope more of those come out. Oh my god! Oh, that's funny. As I'm hoping, sure. I'm hoping us talking about Squid Talk. I'm gonna open TikTok and it'll just be uh, Squid Game Squid memes. Talk. Squid, Squid Talk. Squid Talk. <laughs> <laughs> I realized I said it, but I was hoping I could keep going and no one would bring it up. <laughs> <laughs> There's two of us now. <laughs> You're not safe, <laughs> little old flower nipples. <laughs> You oh cack-handed decade. You cack-handed decade. Ugh. Oh shit, that's funny. So now what? I don't know. Uh oh, time to represent uh my favorite video game on the planet, Star. I got into Smash. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'm so I was actually really happy about that. I don't have a Switch. Um, so Sora got into that. Smash, but um, Donald and Goofy were taken out of the picture. Yeah, yeah, they they <laughs> took like Disney took out all yeah. uh Disney like I, yep. I, which I understand because like Disney doesn't want to be correlated with any fighting games. So like it was already enough. That, like I was pretty surprised that they uh right uh you know did that <laughs> and they got like all the Kingdom Hearts characters which they already have their own roster of characters like tons of 
Uh, yeah, I was pretty surprised, but not, or like I was disappointed, but not, you know. Right, right. Yeah. Pretty cool though, and like just the the screenshot of uh, Sora shaking hands with Mario. That was probably the most fucking surreal thing. It's <laughs> almost like as surreal. Did Did you ever watch uh, Sephiroth's uh, announcement? Uh, oh, in, with him like cutting Mario he, in half or whatever. Yeah, <laughs> and I thought that was the greatest fucking. That was like, I had that picture. I, I would just look at it. I would just laugh because I'm like, <laughs> what in the world? Smash is just such a weird game. Um, Thor is the last one now, right? Like he's they're yes. they're not doing he, anymore now. Yeah, he's the final DLC. A lot of people are upset too because like people wanted a uh, Crash Bandicoot. Uh. Rayman from Rayman Legends. Yeah, they wanted um, this uh, what's that guy's name? Uh, the Slayer from Doom. Whatever Doom, his name is. Doom guy. Doom guy. Yeah, they wanted Doom guy. Uh, Master Chief, I think, was a really big one too. Um, I don't think Crash would have been possible though. I don't think. I I I would have pref- I yeah Crash or like Rayman would have been cool. I don't think. Doom guy or Master Chief would have worked very well. Like I just think that'd I mean, be Master a little. Chief, I think Ma- I think Master Chief would have been kind of cool. Like the idea of like him using like a plasma grenade or a bubble shield Maybe. on like, his defense. Maybe. Like I could see. It. I don't see Doom guy though, just because he just shoots guns, guns right. and jumps high. He really just it. shoots guns and jumps high. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but yeah, I- I'm glad what they chose, and apparently he was like the most, or Sora was the most requested. So I'm glad he got in. <laughs> um. So, do they, are they making another... They probably won't make another Smash until another console comes out, then. Most likely, I, I would imagine. Which, I don't know what uh, Nintendo's plan is for another right. console. Uh, they're probably going to go more into this direction of handheld. Or, like, touch. Because they've been kind of on that roll since the Wii. Like, mm-hmm. you know, motion control. Then after that was the, the, the you know, Wii U. 3DS. And then the Wii U, and now the Switch. So they're definitely on this role of like transportation, yeah, um, and touch and stuff like that. So they're probably gonna expand more on that. Uh, but yeah, you all think about gonna... the Steam Deck? Yeah, I, I saw I'm, that. That looks actually pretty good. That looks pretty good. Um, which sucks because, like, uh, compared to the Switch, like, I, I would love to get the Switch just because <coughs> of Smash and stuff. But like. A lot of their games, it's stream, mm. like stream gaming, which I hate because you can't go anywhere with it. You have to stay right. in a Wi-Fi range. What's the point of a mobile? I mean, obviously not all games are like that, but a lot of the new games that they're coming out with, they're stream gaming. So like, you can't take it anywhere. You are can't. you saying for like, was... Switch or for the stream deck, Steam Deck? For, for Switch, Steam mm. Deck, I think it actually has its own hard drive. Yeah, I think. yeah. I would say they're selling them with like base storages. I'm looking at them now. The cheapest one, four hundred dollars, and it has sixty-four gigabytes. Oh, that's mm. wow! You can maybe uh, most expensive one. You can't even put Halo Master Chief on that. It's six forty-nine, five hundred and twelve gigabytes. Still, (laughs) yeah, but I mean, I'm sure there's going to be different types of sizes for it being a handheld device. Is is it also customizable? Do you know if like you can change Uh, the specs at all? I doubt it, considering its official releases until December. Like that might come later, but okay, yeah, it comes with like, a dock. Ooh, to be able to play it on your TV. Cool. Well, that's cool at least. Yeah. I, uh, I just at this point though, like n- new games nowadays. If you're wanting to like Halo alone is like what 100, 200 gigs, something like it's, that. It's it's like a hundred. Yeah. Yeah. So like. Yeah, but I mean, you already have it on a PC. <laughs> I know, but like the, the whole idea of it is to go somewhere with it. You know, that's like if you want to go camping or, you know. <laughs> I want to go camping, but also but I need to finish the fight. <laughs> yeah, that's, the, that's the whole thing of it. That's just, the whole point. Just like, imagine never... you're in a tent and the tent next to you lights up and you hear, bah, 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 bah. <laughs> <laughs> You hear I go and go, wah, you know. Wah, wah. <laughs> what, what, what? Uh, and, yeah, yeah. But, like, I remember when the Switch commercials were, like, the whole idea of, like, you're able to take it to a park or to a right. basketball game and play, uh, you know, Mario Kart. I'm like, well. 
you obviously, need friends for again, that. Some, some, yeah, you need friends. Uh, which, if you bring a, if you bring a switch to a basketball court, you're probably gonna be, hey, you're probably gonna break your switch if someone's gonna throw a basketball at your head. <laughs> but like, also, that, you that probably don't have friends. And probably also you yeah, don't have friends. Yeah, but yeah. I mean, like, that was their, that was kind of their whole selling point. So I don't, the whole streaming idea doesn't make any sense at all. And right. even like still like streaming, nonetheless, you have to have such a good Wi-Fi to be like stable to like uh, what was the one uh google console that came out like last year or whatever google uh, Fi or no google stadia stadia what, <laughs> what a have fucking... you seen that have you seen that like they can't even run like <coughs> Fortnite on it because it, uh-huh. you have to have such a high you know internet speed to play it right smoothly it, already it, just talked on a... uh ubisoft by the way can i play some siege tonight like we're playing siege tonight. <laughs> <laughs> sorry to sorry to interrupt you there. I just like no, Cody no, no, got no. his his Ubisoft account stuff fixed. So, oh, cool. <laughs> but yeah, I that's my uh, rant about stream games. It makes no sense. I really hope that does not become the new trend or the new future because I feel like it's more of a scam where, oh, now I can just play my games, you know, without having to download it. But I need a really good internet, which costs a shit ton of money. Stupid. Right. I'm I'm pinging One everybody to see a really good internet. <laughs> I I've been trying to push my mom to get a better router for our house because the router we have now is shit. Yeah. yeah. Like it's yeah. in like the center of our house and like we have outdoor cameras on our front and back door and it like can't support them because <laughs> it doesn't have a strong enough connection. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like right when I when when we get our own place like the first thing i'm I'm doing is i want decent i don't need a blazing high speed you know uh, 3000 megabytes a second or anything like that but i want something functional where i can look at my phone look at my computer look at my tv without everything turning uh you know right hate it such a big pet peeve such a big pet peeve or you know we could play halo without input lag or that yeah i would (laughs) like to play halo with my friends without uh it not working right that was my <coughs> rant i will get off my soapbox now we have five minutes left four minutes left does anyone else three minutes three minutes three minutes left two minutes left one minute left, left. <laughs> <laughs> yeah any closing remarks watch squid game if you have not already watch squid game donate money to me so i, I can get a switch buy our merch buy our merch car uh, crash productions dot yeah. store buy you our merch get... so landon can get a switch yeah, yeah. <laughs> you can get this unoriginal uninspired idiosyncrasies in a crew neck or perhaps a tumbler mug i got a sticker <laughs> on my laptop landon here's a deal for you i will sell you my switch at market price but with smash mario kart Mortal Kombat, Breath of the Wild. How much? I don't know. I'll have to Google it. Also, I think it's like 300. <laughs> give me up to date. Oh, like I that. can't do anything now because I'm trying to move out. But fair enough. <laughs> give, me, I, give me up to date. I need to turn, I need to send mine in and get mine fixed. I mine's got the the blinking light of death on the dock. So I... Oh, that sucks. Can you just replace your dock or is it's not the dock? In? The whole because I tried just charging the switch itself and it won't charge. That sucks. Did you? Know, I'll, do I'll you dock it. it I'll do it. You'll do it. You'll you'll dock my uh, switch. I'll dock your switch. Man. <laughs> no, you don't even need to ask. I don't even need to say no more. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, that's gonna be it for this episode. Thank you everybody for watching. Uh, Jared. Idiot. Yep. Idiot. Idiosyncrasies. Bye.